friends and welcome to the ranch of Rivershine. so we did in the last video we did some breeding with the horses and they've now added wild horses that you can catch in various map locations and in pens and stuff like that so i haven't actually done that in the game so we're going to check it out today and i have left a link down below to the game if you want to get it on steam as well as the breeding video in case you wanted to see that as well so here we are in our lovely cozy house which is absolutely adorable part of me wishes that the bed was up in the loft because That'd be kind of cool. Um, so if we go outside, we can see wild horses in pine forest. Hey there, Abigail. I saw some signs of wild horses might be roaming in pine forest. I thought you might want to go have a look. Good luck. Let me know if you catch one of them. So I should have read the instructions, but I didn't unsurprisingly uh, i know that you i think can catch like a bunch of them but then you can only bring like one of them home uh because like the rest of them will like run away if you pick like a specific horse um and if you did see the last breeding video then uh you might notice some, some of the horses are missing i say some a lot of the horses are missing i needed to make room okay we only have two spots i think yeah so snowfall is still my main horse and sunshine and the rest of them are still here barnaby is here he is just out in the field somewhere. Uh, Jade is here. We've got Kildare and Softbee. And I do actually need to take care of them because as you can see, annoyingly, I put them in the paddock when um, I was breeding with them. And so that meant that they weren't getting taken care of, which was kind of annoying. Uh, so it meant that their health has gone down quite significantly. And I'm not sure if I'm going to keep Softbee and Barnaby because their stats... Actually, she has full potential. I think soft B is one of the babies. Oh yeah, I was gonna sell soft B, but I can't because our health is only at 40% and it literally won't let me. Um, so I do have to really quickly take care of all of my horses. I don't know if um, they've added uh, like a stable hand or something that will like auto do it for you. I do kind of hope that they add that in the future. I know that this is supposed to be like a cozy game, so you are supposed to do things yourself, but it's just one of those things where I would like to have a lot of horses, especially if they go out into the paddock. It kind of sucks that the penalty for the paddock is you lose health and so you lose energy and you lose the ability to uh, sell them. It just seems like a bit of a nerf in my opinion. So let me just run through and take care of all of these guys and then we'll hit the road and look for some horses in Pine Forest. So here is Snowfall. Now I have to remember where Pine Forest is. Pine Forest is over there. Um, so we can actually ride straight through, I think. And I haven't caught any wild horses yet. And apparently in certain areas, you'll get certain like types of horses and you'll get like different coats and stats. I think I have the lowest, um, like the lowest stat pen because the highest stat pens were very expensive. So I uh, kind of avoided that. So Again, this game is super like cute and cozy and I really do like it, but I just, I haven't been playing it for myself in quite a while. I don't know why. Ooh. What do I do with the pen though? I probably should have done more research on this, but I didn't. Oh, oh, it has them on the map. Okay. Oh, there they are. I can see them off in the distance. Okay. I wonder how I do this. Okay, I am seeing so many pretty horses. I see a chestnut. There's a white horse or a gray horse, I should say, back there. Um, there is like a paint or a painter. Let's see. Oh, that one looks like a Rocky Mountain horse. How do I make them go towards the pen? Okay, I'm gonna use this black horse as like a test to see what happens. Do I have to maybe dismount? Hello, pony. Can I touch you? Oh, I have to corral you, I think. E to inspect. R to adopt. Oh, so I can just, <laughs> I can just walk up to them. They don't... Oh, I mean, that black horse is really pretty. <gasps> Wait, the Cremello. Oh, I want that one. Oh, I want that one so much. I'm kind of tempted to try and corral that Cremello. Hello. Oh, look, she's so cute. This way, this way, please. Yes. Oh, these jumps are the bane of my existence. Okay, okay, okay. You, we are corralling. We are corralling you. Do I know if this is correct? No, I don't. But I think that this feels right. This feels right. So I'm gonna do this. Go on, horsey. Go on, horsey. Are you in there now? Does that mean I can approach you? Hi, pony. Can I talk to you? Oh, yeah, yeah. So they're, they're distracted eating. So eat, inspect. 
Oh, gosh, I'm so sorry. Okay, pet the wild horse's head. Okay, um, here? Yeah, fierce cougar. <laughs> Feels more comfortable around you. Okay, inspect again. Do I get any more, like, information on them? I don't think so. Okay. So, Fierce Cougar, you wait here. I'm gonna go see which other horses they have. Oh, God, it looks like Spirit. Oh, the black one's really nice, though. Okay, I'm gonna try and get the Spirit horse in. I mean, I know that's not technically Spirit's coat. Oh, oh, can we also get the Rocky Mountain? No? Okay. Uh, we'll just focus on the Spirit horse. And we'll try and get that into the pen. Let's push this horse... Slightly further in. Are you ch are you chill now? Can I pet you on the head? Can I pet you? Yes, yeah, strong tornado. That's absolutely a spirit. Um, is it holdy to inspect? Oh, can I inspect? For oh, I can inspect from the side. He's a buttermilk buckskin. If I pet you again, that's all the information I get. Okay. All right, that's cool. Can I pet you, Smokey? See, I I knew that. I want to know their stats. Okay, um, I might get one more. Maybe I'm tempted. Oops, hello, Snowfall. <laughs> I'm tempted to either get the Black Horse or the Rocky Mountain. Or the one that- I'm referring to it as the Rocky Mountain because it looks like the coats they have. But, uh, I don't actually know what the- <gasps> Look, they're both together. Those two are the ones I want. Okay, maybe I can do them together. How about that? Okay, sorry, Chestnut. Go, ponies. Go, 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 go. That way, that way, that way, that way. Yes. Oh, these two are so cute. I love the Rocky Mountain. Love, 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 love it. Oh, they're so pretty. How am I going to choose? Because I'm pretty sure you literally only get one. Okay, we'll start with the Rocky Mountain and we'll go to get the Black Horse in a second. I know I said I was only going to get one more, but fine. <laughs> there you go. Where's the Black Horse gone? Okay, he's not too far away, thank goodness. How am I gonna choose? I don't know. This is a fun activity though. Obviously, taming wild horses looks very, very different in many games. In Red Dead, you just, you can either brute force it and like catch the horse with the lasso and sit on it until it accepts you, or you can like pet it and go like the more calm route. Um, in Horse Tales, you throw orbs at the horse. Um, in Minecraft, you just sit on it repeatedly until it loves you. But this feels a bit more organic. Like, I like the fact that I can corral them in here so I can sort of get a better look at them. So let, let me give you a pat. If you tell me the coat, I'm Clearware. That's the horse's name. Like, Tupperware. See, I knew it was a black horse. I was hoping for some more... Well, I was hoping for some more information, but it's fine. Actually, I am interested to see what this coat color is called. Lively Mountain. I told you it was Rocky Mountain. Chocolate Palomino. Okay. Interesting. So, we do have this spirit-looking horse. Uh, so, I do really, really like this Chocolate Palomino. And I also really like this Cremello. The Cremello paint. Or the Smoky Cream Tobiano is the correct name. But you guys know, know what I mean. I think I'm going to have to go for the spirit looking horse though. The buttermilk buckskin. All right, let's go ahead and adopt. Inspect the what I did. Oh, right. Okay. So, oh, it is a stallion. It literally is spirit. Can I adopt now? Oh, I have another thing to inspect. I have to inspect its bum, do I? Oh my God, I do. <laughs> okay. Okay. So he's a beginner speed, beginner endurance, beginner flexibility and beginner jump. That's probably the best we're going to get in my pens, which sucks, but it's fine. Let's go ahead and pat him one more time and then adopt. Yes, I'm sure. Adopt. All the other horses will run away. I know. Oh, I've been left alone. Okay. Well, it does seem probably that spirit went home. And the rest of the horses ran away. I would have liked seeing some kind of animation there. Um, like, it's not that important, realistically. But uh, it, I think it would have been quite nice to just see, like, the horses, like, run, you know, in, like, a cutscene or something. Just just to see them, like, go so it doesn't, like, oh, I'm by myself now. Now, I am really excited to go see Spirit. The thing is, is I probably have to skip a couple days to be able to see new wild horses. Because I don't think that they're... Like, you, like the mail I showed you at the beginning, you get told where they are. They're not always around. Oh, I see him. Hi, honey. Oh my gosh, he's so pretty. Oh, I didn't mean to mount you. Oh, oh, stop. He's so cute. 
Oh, he's so pretty. <gasps> oh, I'd love to breed with him. I don't even care about stats at this point. Oh, he's so cute. <gasps> he's so much potential. That is awful because potential takes ages, ages to train. Okay, he's already clean. Um, He would need some... Oh, I didn't mean to give him corn. That was a misclick. Oops. That's fine. Let's give him some straw. Um, we can have both of those, I guess. Oh, uh, that's a shame. Okay, so Snowfall did amazingly today. And we now... Oh, can I change his name? Spirit. Um, How cool would it be if we could catch a rain as well? That would be elite. But I... I mean, the, the likelihood of that is basically slim to none. Um, I'll go ahead and sleep and we'll see if there are any tomorrow. If not, I'll care for the horses, make sure they're okay. And maybe we can pop out again to see if there are any wild horses. Oh, I saw some signs of wild horses have been roaming in Lupin Meadow. Lupin? Lupine? Probably Lupin. Lupine. I'm going to say Lupine. Uh, I thought you might want to go have a look. Good luck. Yada yada. Thank you, Jai. Is it? J or Jai? Might be J because it's AI. Maybe. Oh yeah, and you can also sprint in the game now, which, oh my gosh, thank you so much. That's such an improvement. Really appreciate that. I think we'll take care of the horses, same as we did yesterday, and then we'll pop out on Snowfall again. Uh, oh wait, do I even? Oh, I do. Okay, I have one more stall slot to fill. I wish I could sell Soft Bee, to be honest. Um, she's really pretty, but, like, I just, I'm not that keen on her. I'd prefer to catch a wild horse at this point, which is a shame, but she's just not, I don't think, healthy enough. I don't know if you have to be at 100% to sell the horse, or if the other criteria, I might even pop in to see if I can sell her today. We'll have to see. So, I think that's, uh, did I brush her? I didn't. Okay, here we go. You brushy, brushy, brush. Here we go. And now I have to do that like one, two, three, four, five more times. Okay, that's all the horsies taken care of. That did take a fat minute to do, but it's fine. Let's go ahead and grab Snowfall. Oh, I clicked the wrong button. Um, we'll head into town because I think that's how you get to Lupin Meadow is through the town. And I might maybe pop in to the auction house just to see if I can sell Soft Bee. Um, it's not urgent because I do still have a spare stable slot, but realistically, I would kind of like to free up that just in case tomorrow there's also some wild horses. Um, also, they changed the town. It just feels so much more alive now. I I think it was just they had just done some uh, tweaks to it and improved it and stuff like that. And I have to admit, the first time I rode in, I was like, oh my goodness, this place is absolutely gorgeous. Uh, so I'm really glad that they're still sort of tinkering away at the game. And as I said, it is in the description below if you'd like to play it for yourself. So we're just going to pop into the auction house. Oh, I can. I can sell Sunshine, which I'll do. Oh, she's so cute. She is really cute, but she was a horse that I bought, I think, anyway. So um, we'll let them sort of auction her off. So we've got a nice a nice um, 3k. So obviously we don't want to sell Kildare or Spirit. I was expecting to be able to sell Soft Bee. Oops. But she is not ready to. Obviously, she doesn't have enough health, which is fine. Because um, we still have a free a free stall slot now. So where do we want to go? I think it's down here. Yeah, Lupin Meadow. Uh, it was probably quicker if I just go to the entrance and then go right. So we'll pop in here. Have a quick look at where the wild horses have placed themselves. Oh, okay. So they're all the way down here. Oh, that's such a headache. So uh, that's that's a bit annoying. I think I'll have to pick 
from the pool that I can see because otherwise um, trying to get multiple of them over is probably going to be a headache. Now, am I kind of rooting for a rain? A little bit. A little bit. <gasps> okay. Ooh, there's some interesting ponies around here. <gasps> the black... I don't even know what you'd call that. Black paint? I want to say Sabino, but I feel like that's not right. This one right here. So cute. There's a bay. It's pretty kind of boring. Oh, that one looks like Sunny. It looks like Sunny literally just skipped the black horse. Oh, look. There's another black horse. <gasps> the black horses are really pretty. I do see a chestnut over there. There's another bay. What kind of bay Sabino? And the good thing is, is this doesn't cost anything. So if I pick up a horse and I don't like it... It's not an issue. Okay, so there is this, like, ready chestnut. I'm not really digging any of them. I mean, the black Sabino is kind of interesting. But I also just like the pure black horse. But I don't know if I'm just being boring. I also really like the bay. I know that's silly, but I just, I do. Also, this black horse is so pretty. Mm, I don't know which one I should get. I don't know if I should get maybe this one. Yeah. Okay, I'll get I'll go with this one. Tell me in the comments which one you think I should have picked. If I should have picked that that black one that's there with the socks, the solid black that's at the back, or the one I'm currently herding. Cause I don't know. I think I'm gonna go with this one just because it's more interesting, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. I am glad we've got another spree, a free um, stable slot because we can maybe go out tomorrow and pick up another one. I am again, because I just think it would be so perfect if I was able to pick up a rain horse. Like how genuinely perfect would that be? Where are we going by the way? I actually, oh, I've, I've pushed the horse into a wall. Okay, I think it's down this way. It's quite far away, that's all I know. Can we, oh honey, I'm so sorry. Can we, oh, you can't go this way. What, what am I going to do? Can you go? Yeah, yeah, okay, okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay, let's, uh, this is going to be such a headache. <laughs> Can you go this way? Okay, 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 slow down. Let's, uh, let's control ourselves here. Can you go this way? Yeah. Okay, all right, okay, we're back on track. We are back on track. I'm just going to really quickly check in the map. The pen is right up ahead. Okay, I'm kind of hoping for a mare because I think that that would be really fun to be able to breed them. Okay, are we good? We're good. Okay, okay. The horse is kind of freaking out. Okay, it's okay. Hey, oh no. I'm sorry, I don't mean to freak you out. Can I... Oh, 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 she feels more comfortable. She doesn't look more comfortable. She actually looks quite concerned. I think she's still rendering it as like a, a thing that she's stuck on, but she's not. Okay, let's uh pat you here. Okay, so she's a black splash. Please don't kick me, please. She's beginner and everything. And on this side, oh, it's a stallion. I don't really need another stallion, though. Mm, I'm tempted to go and get one of the black horses now, because what if they're a mare? I wish I could see... Can I go up to... I can't, right? I really wish I could see it from afar, right? Because I feel like I can see the colour. Why would I not be able to see the gender if you get what I'm putting down? This one, I think, is the solid black. There is also, like, a sp Blash of Vero or something, whatever this is. There's a chestnut. I do like the bay. I'm not gonna lie. It is boring, but I do like the bay. Okay, I'm gonna pick this horse instead. Uh, don't go that way because you're gonna get stuck. Um, I'm gonna. Mm, no, I'm sorry, Snowfall. I'm gonna pick this horse because it's slightly more interesting than the solid black. And I have a feeling that this might be a mare. I could be completely wrong because I was wrong about the last one. <gasps> Please don't go into the trees. Okay. Let's, let's head this way. Okay, I know there's a fence there. You should have seen it. Ah, where are you going? Come back. I'm terrible at this. Okay, hold on. This way, this way. Yep. Yeah. I'm so bad. Okay, come on. All right, there we go. We're back on track. Okay, I'm going to push you just down. Oh, down this way. We're at a full gallop right now. You're very hard to control, but I'm really hoping that you're a mare. Let's see how we do. So we're going to give you... Oh, Lush Breeze. What a gorgeous name. Right, so you're black. Probably could have, you know, realized that. Beginner everything, as I expected. Oh, <gasps> you're a mare! Yeah, let's adopt. Okay. Yay! So now we have to go all the way back home. Uh, this shouldn't take too long because you can just uh, teleport back to the entrances. Home, sweet home. Now, I don't remember 
how to do the breeding. I'm pretty sure they just need a lot of health. And I think that there's like a percentage chance that they'll breed. So mm, I have one of two choices. I could set up a breeding with our new Mare Lush Breeze and hope for the best. Or I could wait until tomorrow to see if maybe we can pick up a different mare. Because I don't know what I'd want to do. Because maybe there's a better mare. I don't know. I think I'll go. I'll, I'll sleep on it. I'll sleep on it. I'm kind of hoping that tomorrow there'll be wild horses. But sometimes they they like skip a day. So you won't necessarily get a wild horse every single day. And I... <laughs> I bet that I won't get it tomorrow, in which case I'll have to run out, take care of the horses, and then skip again. So, that's going to be interesting. It was a good day at the ranch. Okay, please let there be horses for me. No, there's no horses. Otherwise, they would have told me. Okay, no stress, no panic. Uh, I'm going to skip today as in I'm going to do today, and then uh, you guys will come back tomorrow. So the horses got taken care of and fed and everything. And I'm really hoping, please. Yes, okay. Sign of horses. Oh, Lupin Meadow again. That one kind of sucked. I'm not going to lie. It did kind of suck. All right. Anyway, we'll suit it up and boot up. And I think I'm just going to do snowfall today. But I know you guys skipped most of it. But it does... Like, this, this care mechanic does get really tedious, especially if you're doing, like, many days in a row. I could put a lot of these horses in the paddock, but they're just going to lose health, which is just going to be more of a pain if I need them or if I wanted to breed or, like, whatever it was. So, there's kind of no point. But then at the same time, I'm eating through my resources. So, yeah. It is a bit... It's a bit tough because, in my opinion, this game is really good. But... In the review I left, I was also talking about how it misses the mark in some elements in terms of how, like, violently grindy it is. And at the same time, it does penalize you for a lot of things. And I'd love to do, like, a video essay on the way horse games punish you for things. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, so I thought that that was a good idea. And I think Ranch of Shrine does give a pretty good basis of, like... Star Stable as well, like generally horse games punish you for not doing the really grindy tasks and I just would like to see that changed at some point. Anywho, here are the wild horses. I'm not straight off the bat seeing any that I like. So there's a dark bay, two chestnuts, a black, this overo looking horse. There's a black one again and there is this sort of like dark i know the name i want to say liver chestnut but i'm not sure i don't think that's a liver chestnut um i'm tempted to have a look at this splash if it's not a mare i'm gonna be so upset please okay no pony what did you just do how did you go through this pony oh my god <laughs> wait the horse can go through the hedges but i can't Oh, that I'm not doing a maze. That's just no. Okay, this horse is lost. The horse is lost. I I am not doing that. I'm not like if the horse can go through the the bushes, then like no, nah, that's gonna kill me. I can't do it. Okay, mm, I'm thinking since I didn't find any horses that I like today, instead I'll take Spirit and I'll breed with him. I reckon uh, we'll breed with the black horse. I'm thinking. Uh, I was just thinking, because I think it was Sims 4, I just did a recording on breeding spirit in The Sims 4. There's going to be a lot of Spirit Stanley the Cimarron inspired content on my channel soon. I, I've not actually done that on purpose. This was not to be not supposed to be Spirit Stanley the Cimarron themed, but it has become it. Um, as much as I would like a rain to breed with, the chances of that happening is slim to none. And today, Lupin Meadow sucked with the wild horses. So what I'm going to do is I am going to take care of both of these guys. So we're taking... This is a very slow process to scroll through the horses. <laughs> Okay. Mm. Lush Breeze. Okay, they only have a 67% chance, but let's go ahead and try and pair them anyway. 
maybe something will come out of that. We don't know. Um, <laughs> Lush Breeze already wants to leave. She's gone straight to the gate. She's saying help. Help, help, let me out. The these two, I don't think, are getting on. I feel like this is a bit unfair on Lush Breeze. Sorry, gal. Sorry. I just, I want foals. Oh, Lush Breeze is pregnant! Yay! Okay, awesome. And there are no wild horses today. Shame. Okay, so Lush Breeze is already pregnant, which is actually really good because we're going to be skipping a few days. Um, where have they gone, actually, now that they're pregnant? Okay, Soft Bee is still here. Can I take you out of there? Remove horses. Okay, yay! Okay, so they're going to probably chill out in here. Uh, I don't think Lush, Lush Breeze's um, health matters, but I'll keep Spirit's health up. Although the care has stayed at 100%. So maybe maybe she's changed that, actually. Because I know people were complaining about the paddock. So maybe she's changed that. I haven't read all of the patch notes, which is quite bad of me. Um, but that's fine. That's fine. So the main thing is, is now I have no stall spaces. Because the new baby will take up the only spare stall space that I've got. So I do need to sell Soft Bee pretty soon. But I'm not sure if she's ready. I won't push it. Because I'll just keep taking care of her and go to bed. And if tomorrow we get wild horse sightings that aren't in Lupin Meadow. If I get another sighting in Lupin Meadow, I'm just not going to go. Because the horses just seem really boring. Um, and I kind of want interesting looking horses anyway. So we will skip that if that comes up. And if we do get a horse, a wild horse sighting in a place we do want to go in, we'll pop into town and see if Soft Bee can be taken to the market yet. Okay. Please... Ah, there's no wild horses today. Oh, that's upsetting. Okay, that's fine. Let's take out the horses again. See if there's any more tomorrow. Okay. If I get wild horses at Lupin Meadow again. Okay. Pine Forest. That's a shame. I was hoping for Crystal Lake just because we hadn't had that one yet. But Pine Forest was very good to us last time. So I'm not too mad. Now, the main thing is, is Soft Bee needs to be able to be sold. Otherwise, I can't pick up this horse. So let's hope. I mean, she's at 100%. She's got to be able to, right? You know what? I don't even think I need to take care of her. I think I could just go. I'm going to take care of um, Snowfall. That horse is very pretty. I'd like one of those. Oh, there's new horses every day. Oh, that's so dynamic. I love that. It makes it feel like it's genuinely a new day. Ooh, this, this horse reminds me of the Star Stable Connemara. It's so pretty. I love it. Okay, let's go ahead and sell Soft Bee. So it does give us a decent chunk of cash. And I do kind of need to recoup some of the items that I've lost from taking care of the horses so frequently. So um, that's going to be need to be something that I do. Um, So... Let's go ahead and guide to here. Oh, and they're in the same spot as before. That's so much handier than the one at Lupin Meadow. That place sucks to find wild horses. It really does. So this is the same pen we used to get Spirit. And I'm really hoping that we're going to get some lookers. Um, they should be just around here. Yeah, I see a few of them. Okay. <gasps> Do I see a Cremella? Is it the same Cr Cremella? No, it's not. It's a slightly different... Oh, it's like a golden horse. Oh, it's Spirit's mum, sort of. Let's see what else we've got. So we've got a cream, I think. Oh, this chestnut is so cute. Wait. Rain's a chestnut. But then this one also looks like his mum. I mean, it doesn't have... Because she had like a stripe and socks. Because that one doesn't have it. But that chestnut could pass for rain. If it's a if it's a stallion, I'm going to be thoroughly upset. Just just deeply and thoroughly upset, guys. Okay, go ahead and hit hit the like button just in case it helps with the odds. Also, apparently, when you say that now, the like button uh, lights up. So that's fun. That's why I've started saying it. But yeah, if you hit the like button, maybe this will be a mare. Maybe. I'm really hoping this is going to be a mare. Okay, let's let's run you over to the pen. I mean, it's not like a spitting image of her, but it's probably the closest we're going to get. Okay, please. Please be a mare. Okay, calm down. Natural bison. Okay, chestnut Tobiano. 
Yes, I'm there! Oh my god! Thank you. If you hit the like button, you cause that. Thank you. I appreciate it. My camera is overheating <laughs> so, because I've been recording for like an hour. Um, and I'm starting to think I would really, really love to breed her in spirit. But I don't think I'll be able to in this video. <laughs> and I'm not doing that as like an influencer thing. I genuinely think my camera's gonna die before I get the chance to. So I'm so sorry. Let me know in the comments if you'd like me to do a separate video where I breed Spirit and Rain because we were so lucky to get those two. Um, basically the spitting image of them both. Uh, but I don't think we'll be able to breed them in this video. I'm so sorry. So we'll run back home. I actually can't remember how long it takes to breed the horses, uh, like, for a pregnancy to, like, actually finish. What's the word I'm looking for? For the birth to happen, basically. I don't know how long that is, time frame-wise, because I know that Soft Breeze is, or Lush Breeze, sorry, is pregnant. Um, so, I don't know if I can maybe wait for that to happen. Oh, I didn't mean to give her corn, I keep doing that so silly okay rain is taken care of and speaking of that wasn't what i meant to do i wanted to do this so instead of natural bison which is a curious name um we're going to name her rain right let's go out into the paddock and see how lush breeze is doing hello honey oh she's got a bit of a pregnant belly she's got a big enough pregnant belly <gasps> Oh, it's so cute. Okay, I'm starting to think that we leave the breeding for the next video just because I, I feel like I've run out of time today. Uh, otherwise, this video is just going to be far too long. So uh, let me know in the comments if you want to see Lush Breeze's fall and Rain get pregnant and what her fall looks like. Let me know in the comments below. And uh, yeah, also just a quick note. I was supposed to mention this in the video, but I forgot. If you like Brea horses, you can go ahead and check out pinehavenponies.co.uk because we're selling Brea model horses to the UK and internationally as well. So keep an eye on for any sales or promotions that we do on there as well all linked down below so i hope you guys enjoyed stay positive and i'll see you in the next video Bye bye